Test alert. My main goal is to This is a test of the North. How's it going, guys? Thunderbody01 here, along with... Ari McClanahan from Digital Alert Systems. Did you know that you can get the Uptrade program and trade your older unit for newer, brand new units? God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey, you think, you, think it's all, you, think it's all, you think it's all settled now? Just, wait, just, just imagine if Michael joined right now. Cool. <laughs> oh. he joins in the voice chat? <laughs> all hell break loose. Uh, this is the part when the next person in the sequence goes next. That's Chaos Mox, followed by... Miss Starlight, a.k.a. the person that simps for Michael alongside Mikado, I mean, what? Oh, Jesus Christ, Holly. Oh, Jesus Christ, Holly. Wow. <laughs> epic. Yes, epic indeed. I just realized I had her volume set to 200%. Alright, uh, next person. That's, uh, that's yeah. Makoto, everyone. <laughs> Hello, yeah. me, I think. Hello, um, Javier is with us, but he's currently muted. But this is SBC Ashland 9467. Uh -oh. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> oh my god. That's a lot. I didn't know you was gonna speak or not. I'm sorry, man. I don't know. <laughs> it's, just that, it's just that too many people are talking all at once, so it makes it difficult to hear. Yeah let's, try, oh, yeah, yeah, let's try to keep it uh, one at a time. Yeah. Hey, the phone called at LAE. Oh, boy. We already got a uh, EMS <laughs> during a live unboxing. This should be from the NWS camp. Hold on. Let's listen. A civil authority has issued a local area emergency for the following county slash areas. Following out at 11.52 and on 17, 2000, and the effect of until 7 p.m. as from WDF slash NWS. Following as to Matt Smith at Great West of the moment of the emergency management agency. A catastrophic flooding is occurring in Bowen County and impacting many areas and roads. This is an extremely dangerous situation. Please do not travel on area roadways unless you have an emergency. Please the road clear for emergency personnel. If you must travel due to an emergency, never drive through a flooded roadway. Also be extremely cautious of debris that may be on the roads. Am I the only one that thinks that voice is absolutely creepy? Ah, uh, you're not exactly the only one. That was kind of creepy. Uh, it's no, I thought it was the top and that's saying yeah. something. No, that's... Baldwin, 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 that's uh, Flash Flood Productions, I guess. Um, he didn't really say his name. And then, uh, next? Obviously, Abigail, the only... Wait, not, not the only one. <laughs> ah, I don't know. I want to 
say make a reference, but I have a funny feeling I might give him a copyright notice, so no music. Yeah, let's keep copyrighted music to a minimum here. So. <laughs> All right, so uh, five minutes later, literally five minutes later of doing introductions, and, we, and we're finally getting to the main point of this video. We're going to be unboxing a WR300. But Nicholas, wait, you have three other ones. Why are you getting a fourth? Well, first of all, oh you, you just ruined. Oh my goodness. So, Adam Miller came in. Fantastic. This is the fourth best, I tell you. Okay, listen, Adam Miller, you know what? Just censor it out. Just censor it out. Yeah, yeah I, I, pl I plan on censoring it out, all right. So. Yeah, so so we're gonna be doing an unboxing of yet another midland wr300 this is my fourth one now the reason why i got this one if i set my phone down right here because i do not feel like uh i do not feel like doing what i did back in i'm not simping over them i'm it's so, just like a place for, I'm not gonna go there. Alright, yeah. so if I open up the box here. If I open up the box, I take out the radio right here. I take out the power cord, and holy crap, this power cord looks different all freaking ready. This is, dude, this is, this is like, this is like as thin as like the WX268 adapter. It's literally thin. Alright, well... Hey, wait, before we move on, th uh, before we move on further, I need to make a proposal. Alright, what's your proposal? Drew, come off mute, I have something to tell you. What was that? <clears throat> Drew, I have to make a proposal. What? Give me a milk. Oh, God. Why? Why? <laughs> give me your milk, I'll give you, I'll give you the e mask. Oh, okay. Give me, wait, oh, wait. Yeah, um, 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 I'm just gonna, I, I am just gonna, yeah, Nicholas, you might want to just continue. Yeah, that's what I plan on doing. So, so right here, you can, you can see the radio is right here. I'm going to take it out of the bubble wrap shortly. The power cord, which is, can't see anything. well, that's because I have my camera off. Excellent. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, because we're not. Yeah, because we're not cool enough to see it. That's why. You'll see yeah. it in a second. <laughs> Anyways, so the power cord is right here again. Pencil thin. One second later, still does not see the radio. <laughs> <laughs> Javier, if I may ask, do you want to see my black and silver the next time we meet up? Hey, it's not as bad as six hundred dollars, but anyway. So I'm just, I'm just gonna say that's that's a ripoff. Absolutely. I got mine for thirty-eight bucks and two sixty. Nice. It's completely off topic from the main subject. Yeah. Um. Anyways, radio, power cord, owner's manual, which I don't think I'll be needing. Uh, product guide. video four hours and twenty minutes. No. And then you have the little yellow slit that's included with every new Midland radio. Um, yeah, I'm surprised they still do the yellow slit. Yeah, probably because uh, this because this way, if if you're an obsessive radio collector like myself, you'll probably wonder you'll you'll probably be asking, "Dude, why does the radio go over the weekly test?" But then you look right there and it says, "This is why." Oh, hey, looks like uh, looks like Rat Poop just joined. Gotta go. I have Michael. Okay. Anyways, um, it it's going pretty well. Just unboxing the uh, WR300 that you still need to get. Actually, hey, I, I say you still need to get. You actually ordered one. The WR300. Yeah, uh, mine's coming on Saturday. The other WR300 sent this year. Mine's coming 
Saturday. Oh, nice. Very nice. Actually, I think I, I, I might have got mine as an early birthday gift. I would have been one Alright. Anyways. I got before the discount Actually, code expired. Actually, I got mine from Brandon Crocker, so, yeah. Anyways, pardon me while I set my phone down. I'm just, uh, clearing some space so this way I can set my new 300 somewhere. Um. Let's, uh, plug this guy in right there. And just for... Sexy radio unboxing. I'm gonna be a All right. So just for just for the purpose of this video, I'm gonna set it over by my Nintendo Switch. Which if you oh well, you can't really see it from that angle because of how low the phone is right now. But it'll be right there for now, next to the hard drive. So I'm gonna take out the bubble wrap. Excuse me. What has this video turned into? Oh right, a living hell. It is this in hell, that's what it's turned into. Oh, what the voice channel get changed? <laughs> what? Okay, who changed the voice channel name? <laughs> Big sexy WR300 on- Oh my god. <laughs> anyways. Why me? So, anyways, before I actually plug the radio in, I'm gonna set it- Anyways, I'm gonna set the radio right here for now. I'm gonna have, I have its own place set up in, an, in another room. But before I do anything, I'm gonna do what every EAS enthusiast does whenever they get a new radio, and press every single button to wish the radio good luck in service. Now, I'm gonna have to do this one-handed here. You suck. Anyways. I'm gonna, I'm plugging in the radio now. And if I remember correctly, this should be a version eight. Yup, it is. It is. I just just caught the lamp test. It's a version eight. Anyways. Yeah. Um. First thing to note already: the button beeps sound exactly like the seventy four two hundreds button beeps. Like, listen to the. And there's also a little bit of, of a delay when you press the button before the backlight turns on. I'm not sure if anyone else has noticed that. And I'm getting an a insane amount of menu lag. This is going to drive me absolutely nuts. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is change the alert modes of voice. Set the backlight to continuous. Pretty much. And set the time. It's, it's, oh, already. Different different part about the menu. It actually starts you off in PM instead of AM. I actually just noticed that. Okay. The, okay, the menu lag is already... Alright. But yeah, um... Already, this menu lag is already driving me nuts. Today's the 16th of September. Of 2020. I hope there's an option that'll let you disable the button beeps on this because the fact that this is. If there's an option to disable the button beeps on this thing because. Alright. So, county code's already set to all. I'm gonna do defeat siren real quick. So the sim the setup is already similar to that of the version fives. That I've already noticed. Warning. 
Nice. And I see Karsis has rejoined the call. Hello, I was working on something. So. Oh, don't worry. Don't worry. I'm actually working at the moment. I'm just muting myself. Oh, shit. I too got a radio today. Oh, you did? Not a weather radio, but a very, very rare weather radio to find. Alright, you said it was a weather radio, now you're saying it's a very good one. Wow, that's cool. That's cool. Let's hear the fishing box. Yeah, that's. It's called the Federal Science Signal Academy. It's the Federal Science Signal. It's the Federal Science Signal. Did that just. 1010. What is that to start playing? These go to these. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. And we just built a whole new for it. Oh, all right. Uh, I hate to. I was just talking. My phone just decided to start playing Spotify. Hey, Oof. But uh, okay. Already a complaint about this radio. Why is National Silent Test with the N code, the N prefix, before Extreme Wind Warning? Like, no, that's. Yeah, why would they put it there? That's a little stupid as well. And. Yeah. yeah. Oh, uh, special marine warning. Yeah, let's just disable that. No. Um. <laughs> oh wow! Storm surge warning is already programmed into here. So. All right. I will say the reason why I got this version of the WR three hundred. Is because the so the reason I got this specific version of the WR three hundred is because the newer event codes like storm surge warning and wash, as well as extreme wind warning, are already programmed into here. Unlike the version fives, where you have to program it in yourself using the add events feature, this is actually a lot more convenient. Yeah, it sounds about right. Up. Oh. Hold up. Um either I'm stripping. I think mid I think Midland might have just removed some of the transmitter codes cuz I only see two on here and there are four. And then unrecognized, I'm just going to disable those, because I do yeah, not like... Oh, and then they have child abduction emergency yeah. right after the unrecognized yeah. ones. Yeah, and then the custom alerts, which I will add off camera. Oh, okay. And then... Siren... Oh, actually, siren level. So, if you have a version 5 like myself... One thing you'll notice already about the siren, about, the, about adjusting the siren level with the version 8s. It has the version 5 uh, test siren on there for setting the siren level. Whereas opposed to the version 5s, you get like a some sort of alarm clock sound, so to speak. I'm going to leave it on low for now since, uh, since it's kind of late. But I'm going to do the siren test right now. So, the siren test on the version 8. Holy crap, it sounds like a sped up version of the WR120. Exactly. I mean, it's not that bad, It's cool. Hey, again. So, it's basically a grand mixture of all Midland weather radio combined. I wouldn't say all, mainly. It, was, it has the fast pace of the 400. Which, uh, by the way, Zion still needs to get a 400. F*** you! That'd be our 400. Is that an uh, offer? Is that an offer? Aw, <laughs> <you. laughs> uh, hell no! Anyways, um, so it takes the overall fast siren uh, function from the 400 and combines it with the 120's uh, siren tone, so to speak, because there's actually... If I'm not mistaken, if, if I'm not mistaken, I believe there's some sort of tone generator inside these radios that gives them the sirens that they have. So, yeah. 
it takes the tone generator from the 120 and basically speeds it up like the 400 and then you have the version 8 siren with the button beeps oh, you basically just take Oh, yeah, yeah, shows tornado warning, face to black. Oh, and yep, there it is. Oh, did you actually got a tornado warning for once? Um, I'm gonna post a picture of this. This way, uh, I could not be yelled at in the in the voice chat for not showing the uh, the radio in its true glory. And I just noticed that the way I hold my camera, you can actually see a little bit of the backlight kind of shining off on there, kind of like a reflection. That is cool. But and already I can tell the backlight is hella bright. It's brighter than my WR301. I will say that right now. And that backlight on there is bright. So. I'm going to set the whole custom alerts thing later. I'm going to set the custom alerts, like the newer alerts in later. But with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the version 8 WR300 unboxing. Like always, be sure to strike some likes, flood that notification. Uh, ah, dang it, I messed it up. Um, strike them likes, flood that subscribe button, and twist that notification bell. And also be sure to... What the f*** are you doing, Zion? I just saw you go derp head out of the out of the shot. He's he, he's trying to be he's trying to basically try to never mind. I thought he'd know. Uh oh. <laughs> Anyways, uh, be sure to also subscribe to these people that are on the call, and uh, yeah, be sure to subscribe to these people that are on the call as well as the people that were on the call earlier. And with that being said. I hope you guys enjoyed. This is ThunderBuddy01 signing out along with. <laughs> yes, buddy. Perfect, perfect, perfect way to end the video. <laughs> Alright, guys. Well, that was pretty good. Uh, that was pretty good. Yeah, 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 that was Uh, JD, that J Hello? Hello, you dead? Awkward silence. He died. Hey, you're supposed to fucking die. <laughs> That's JD. So just died. And then, uh, Logna. I don't know if that's, uh... I think that was supposed to be a Pokemon. I can't even smell that. Are you sure it's not Ligma? There we go. This is Ligma. Yeah, Mr. Wumi is myself because uh yeah, I kind of identify as a uh, that 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 yeah, that yeah, Mr. Wumi is myself. I mean there's nothing to really assume about my gender. I'm I'm Funny how everyone is joining back as I'm about to end the video, <laughs> bet. This happens with my stuff all the time. It's bad. It's one thing. Unboxings. If you enjoyed the video, you should go to www.wdfaradio.com and listen to the video. All right. Yes. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, um, this is Thunderbody01 signing out along with pretty much these people that have joined the call and as well as those that were on the call earlier. And uh, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time. Let's go!